Okay, miss it now. Uh, I would request uh, Vivek ji to. I request Vivek ji to say a couple of words, and then we'll get started after Palvi Ma'am and Rashindi speaks. Good evening, everyone. Wonderful people of Pune. Whatever I have to say, I've said in the film. And before we even planned where to screen the film, the first city which I had decided was Pune. And at that time, there was only 50% capacity was allowed. And he said there are going to be 200 people. So therefore, we booked a much bigger hall with some 350 seating so that people can sit at alternate seats, but now we are here. If you want to go to the back of the seats, you can go. Numbering was only for formality, I think. So that you can do. Um, this film is not a film. Actually, when it started, we didn't even know whether we were going to make a film or write a book or make a documentary or what to do or just collect all the data, put it on uh, YouTube. We had no clue. And just, I want to tell you why Pune is so important. Because when, when I started researching on Kashmir, a young boy came to my office to meet me. And he saw lots of books on Kashmir over there. He said, sir, why do you have so many books of Kashmir? I said, I'm researching whether there is a material for making a film on Kashmir. Because I believe this story must be told. But it's very difficult to tell this story because whatever we have seen so far or heard so far, <coughs> is only from political point of view. As I always say, we have talked a lot about Kashmiris, but we have never So he told me a wonderful thing. He said, he said Sir, keep your books on a kinare. Rakhiye. Just go and read all the victims of Kashmir genocide. And that's how this journey started because it was a life-changing idea. And we went on to do interviews and video testimonials of more than 700 first generation victims of Kashmir genocide. First generation means whose parents were killed or they were, uh, somebody was raped in their family or their houses were burned. We decided to do only first generation. Then we collaborated with a whole lot of historians and administrative people, Lieutenant Governor Jagmohan Saab and all those people. And it took us four years. And today we are going to present a film which is based 100% on all those video testimonials. Everything has been cross-checked, not once, but 100 times. Every dialogue, every...